Stop scrolling around. Hey, I'm Canute, and these are my men. That's just going to cause more trouble. What are you doing here? We serve no master and take whatever we want. You're bandits, then. I prefer the term freelance adventurers. We took this oasis with the help of the nomads. Sure, why not? And? Have you got any plans? We've been thinking about attacking Bakaresh, but that's a few sizes too big for us. What if we attack Bakaresh together? You're really serious about this, huh? You see, this is not a mere village or an oasis. This is Bakaresh, the sacred center of the Hashishan. That means plenty of elite warriors, black mages, and booty. Yes, that's right. It's a one in a lifetime chance, but it's an awful risk nonetheless. If we're going to do this, you need to be well prepared. You really think? So, are you in? You know, I can't decide that by myself, and I wouldn't take this on without my damn partner Reg anyway. Also, I have no idea what Adarus will think of this. I mean, the Nomads helped us with the Oasis, but who knows what's really going on in their heads. If you make sure that Reg and that Adarus fellow are going along with it, I'll be willing to risk my neck. I'll take care of it. Hey, get your hands off my... Oh, what do you want? We want to raid Bakaresh. Are you in? Bakaresh? Hmm. There's a lot to be had there. Well, and how are we going to divide the loot? You know how it goes. While one man is still fighting, the next one is already opening the chests. And afterwards, nobody remembers who pocketed what and how much. So, what do you suggest? You get all of the loot but you pay us for the attack in advance. Then I'm in. You know something about plundering, don't you? You know I do. Shall I teach you something more? That ought to be enough. What? Those few coins are all you're offering? Those few coins? Take it or leave it. I hate deals that don't pay, but I won't leave Canute in the lurch. You can count on me. Canute sent me. We are planning to attack Bakaresh. We are not ready for an attack yet. Why not? Sinekar isn't here yet. 
He was going to scout the town. What about you? What do you mean, what about me? I could help you prepare some more if you'd like. Find him. We're going to need his help. We will be ready whenever he is. Find Sinekar. Hey you, what are you doing sneaking around? I am Sinekar, and actually, this is supposed to be a hideout. Well, it's not hidden well enough. Obviously not. You can rest here for a while, but don't try anything stupid, and leave me alone. Atarus sent me. We want to take Bakaresh. How does it look? Are you in? Have you really thought this over? Are you in, or not? We'll need the help of the slaves. We have to make contact with them. You can move about the city freely. Find a slave who is ready to fight with us. One who can motivate the other slaves to start an uprising. Then we'll attack. Do that. I'll go to the Oasis. We'll meet there.
Halt! This is Bakaresh, temple city of the Hashishin. What do you want here, stranger? Are you one of the raiders? I belong to no one. Then stick with it and don't get involved with the raiders. Tell me something about the city. Strangers are not often found here. Seek out Ashnu. He will help you further. How are things? It doesn't look good. Nomads are roaming around outside the city. Those damn raiders have attacked the oasis. Go to the city and report it to Silvio. I am Silvio, and this is Bakaresh. Leave your weapon sheathed as long as you are in the city, and keep your hands to yourself. Then we'll get along just fine. I see. Then stick with it. What can you tell me about the city? This is a beautiful, serene temple city. And that's the way it should stay. If you want to go into the temple, talk to Amul. And if you want to gab for a while, Go see Ashnu. He likes to talk a lot. Otherwise, I'll show you how you can deal with raiders. Do you have work for me? You want to make yourself useful? Akrabor is guarding the north entrance to the city. He hasn't reported to me for a long time. Go and see what's wrong. And while you're at it, check on Benito, too. He's holding the position in the south. Benito sent me. What does he have to report? The oasis outside the city was raided by nomads. Damn, that's bad news. Tisgar isn't going to like that at all. We'd better be careful in the south. Here, this is for you. And carry on. I am Aldo. With me, you can always get what you need. And if Beliar had not stricken my slaves with extraordinary stupidity, I could also offer you some artifacts. Teach me something about alchemy. You mean regarding my imbecile slaves? You could slap them all silly, but what's the use? I have seen to that already. Actually, I meant those artifacts you're looking for. Ah, yes, of course. I am looking for three special artifacts in particular, you know. I have read some old inscriptions. They are small caskets. They belong to a priest of the Ancient Ones. He was certainly a well-respected man. And once I own those caskets, I too will be well-respected. I'll have a look around. If you bring them to me, your reputation in Bakaresh will go up as well. Yes, all right. I think I've got it. Show me your goods.
Welcome to Bakaresh. I am Jafar, weapons merchant. Feel free to have a look at my blades. I have only top quality merchandise from Benzala. Show me your goods. Welcome to Bakaresh, Pilgrim. I am Ashnu. In case you need information, mine is worth gold. What can you tell me about the temple? The temple is the sanctuary of Beliar. We donate gold to the Black Mages so that they may appease his almighty wrath. If you want to pray, you will have to make do with this statue down here. The temple is closed to all strangers, and the Mool alone decides who gets to enter the temple, Pilgrim. What can I do so that Amul will let me enter the temple? You could work for Silvio, of course. Or you could fight in the arena, provided you are a strong and law-abiding son of combat. What else? Any other options? Well, we merchants of the city must pay our tribute to the Black Mages. If you bring Amul our gold, he will know that we trust you. Tell me about the Black Mages. The Mages take care of everything. They pray to Beliar for us. But they also see to the tribute, and they protect us. We are at their command, and Zubin, old and wise, is their leader. But you will not find him here. He watches over us all from his palace in Ishtar. Let me bring Amul your tribute. Of course I shall support your wish, son of generosity. Right then. What should I do? You need to convince Jafar, Carlos, and Aldo. Once you have their approval, come back to me, and I will give you the tribute. I want to take your tribute to Amul. Do you now? But can we even trust you? Maybe you are working for the Nomads, ingratiating yourself here at Bakarash so you can steal our gold. What do you demand, then? I think we should not trust you with our gold. Unless you have pulled off some good deals outside of Bakaresh. What have you got to show for yourself? I have worked for Sancho. Hmm. Every single one of us has dealt with Sancho at some point. That is not good enough. I conducted business with Nafalem. Yes, that is good. You have got experience. I saw that right away. You can go to Amul. You have got my approval. Show me your goods. I want to take your tribute to Amul. You want to deliver our gold? This will increase your reputation with the Black Mages. Exactly. That's the point. Ah, uh, I like it. But certainly you know that you're not the only one who wants that. So... What do you suggest? You do your business with Amul, and you owe me a favor. Just a moment. What kind of favor? Once you have access to the temple, you will recommend me to the Black Mage, Sigmor. You want me to recommend you? Exactly. Let him know what a competent fellow I am. I'll see what I can do. I put my trust in you, son of obligingness. Welcome, Pilgrim. I am Carlos, slave trader. How's business? So far, pretty good. I can't complain. Although, I could use some help anyway. What can I do for you? I still have a couple of slaves I can't get rid of. Listen, Aldo is crazy for ancient artifacts. He already bought some slaves from me that he has digging. And? The problem is... That danger lurks in the ruins. Danger that gobbles up slaves. As long as the ruins are unsafe, Aldo won't buy any more slaves. I see. 
I'll take a look around those ruins. Go ahead and do that. If Aldo buys my slaves, you'll get the cut. I want to take your tribute to Amul. So, he let you into the temple? Exactly. Deal with this business in the ruins, and I'll have nothing against it. I am Ahmed, Ahmed of all trades. You know a thing or two about weapons? I am master of various fighting styles. If you have some gold, I can teach you. Teach me, please. Of course. We can start whenever you're ready. But those among you who do good business must pay their tribute. For what use is your gold in the face of Beliar's inexorable wrath? Once his wrath is awakened, it is too late. Hey, would you fancy a fight? Go talk to Hernando. It's high time I won another match. Mages can appease his wrath. We protect you. Hey, we use our hey you. Power yes, you. I mean you. What do you want? You look like a man who wants to make lots of gold and fast. Who is there to fight? Ah, I present you a marvelous selection of the desert's best fighters. First comes Irhabar the Bloody. He's one tough bastard, and he likes to finish off his vic... Uh, opponents. Slowly. Next, I will send you Ahmed of all trades. There isn't a maneuver he doesn't know. Not a move he has mustered. And the grand finale will be our champion, the undefeated king of Bakarash, Mufasa the Savage. In the course of his career, he has fought in over a hundred matches and hasn't lost many. What are the rules? I'll have you know that no slaves are fighting here in Bakarash. These are the greatest gladiators of the desert. Hashashins who have earned themselves a place in the arena through their deeds and their skills. And the rules? Each fight costs 1,000 gold coins. Besides that, the usual rules apply. Fine. Then I'll knock down the bloody guy first. Excellent. The mysterious fighter from the north. Hey, none of this fancy talk. Just let me fight. Uh, all right, then. At least try to look good. Else you shall pay with your blood. Beliar knows no mercy. There is no pity for the weak, only pain and death. But those among you who do good business must pay their tribute. Show me what you can do. Show me your goods. And his dominion will come. Man, the blood is a bloody mess. You have earned his gold. So pay with your gold. Fine. You shall now let me fight that Ahmed, the one of all blades. No Trades. There is no His Ahmed of all... Ah, forget it. You death. paid so you but can those fight. among you who do good business must pay their tribute. For what use is your gold in the face of Beliar's inexorable wrath? Once his wrath is awakened, it is too late. Oh, good. Then will your prayers fade away?
Show me what you can do. Show me what you can do. <laughs> 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 Show me what you can do. <laughs> Show me.
Show me what you can do. Show <clears throat> Next time, 
Telling you, we are the chosen people. Wealth for us, dominion for Belial, and his dominion will come. But have you done to Ahmed? The man's completely worn out. Isn't that why I fought him? Well, yes, you've got a point there. Fine. Now bring on this savage fellow, and then I'll be champion, right? Whoa, 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 there, whoa, I never said that. What? Are you toying with me? No, no, no of course not. Father of swift combat. But you still need to go up against the Temple Fighters. Special order from this guy. Only if you can hold your own against the Temple Fighters will you be named champion of Bakaresh. Why didn't you tell me this before? Hey, you didn't ask. But it will bring you glory and honor. And hopefully some gold, too. Send in Mufasa, then. Ah, a great sound for a great fight. Hey, please slow down a little this time. Got it? The audience expects to see something for their money. Wealth for us, dominion for Beliar, and his dominion will come. And then those who have drawn his wrath shall tremble. So pay with your gold, else you shall pay with your blood. Beliar knows no mercy. There is no pity for the weak or the shame. You're as good as defeated. <laughs> You're as good as defeated.
it's back. <sighs> You're as good as defeated. You're as good as defeated. <clears throat> You're as good as the. There's going to be a fight, man. <clears throat> As good as the fire.
You're as good as defeated. You're as good as defeated. <sighs> You're as good as defeated. You're as good as defeated. Oh! <clears throat> 
Stop right there, you dog. Right here in the arena of Bakarish, the impossible became reality. Mufasa the Savage has been defeated. Here stands the victor. And he has come to get his gold. But of course, vanquisher of Mufasa. I told you I would make you rich. Right. Now what about the temple fighters? Those aren't just any old fighters, oh no. One of them was the gatekeeper of Ishtar, and the other used to hunt nomads all over the desert. Both had earned this job in Bakarish, and struck down more opponents than all barbarians combined. Never mind. You know what I want. Bring on the temple fighters. So be it. Let the fight for the crown begin. Eternal fame for the winner, a mouthful of sand for the loser. Good luck, fighter. I'm curious to see how long you last. We are the chosen people. Wait for us. Dominion for Beliar. And his dominion will come. And then those who have drawn his wrath shall tremble. So pay with your gold. You're a You're as good as defeated. Stop right there, you dog. Stop right there, you dog. Give <laughs> 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 what 
Stop right there, you dog. Let him beat you! <laughs> Stop right there, you dog! Stop right there, you dog. You're as good as defeated. Stop right. 
right there, you dog. Stop right there, you dog. Wealth for us, dominion for Beliar, and his dominion will come, and then those who have drawn his wrath.
dominion for Belia, and his dominion will come. And then those will You're as good as defeated. Stop right there, you dog. And his dominion will come. And then those who have drawn his wrath. You're as good as the you left the arena. You have been defeated. You're as good as defeated. Stop right there, you no! dog. Him beat you. Stop right there, you dog. <sighs> Will you? 
you. Stop right there, you dog. <laughs> there, let him beat you. Stop right there, you dog. Will you? <laughs> Stop right there, you dog. Stop right there, you dog.
Stop right there, you dog. Him beat you. No, 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 Show me your goods. Next time, I'll show you. Since that business with the trolls, animal fights have been forbidden in the arena. Trolls? Yeah, it was Amal's idea. He wanted to make things more spectacular. It was quite a spectacle, all right, but not exactly the way he imagined. There is no pity for the weak, only pain and death. But those among you who do good business must pay their tribute. For what you I'm at the loss for words, O oh, champion of Bokoresh. Now that's a nice change of name. You are truly a great lady, though. Glory and honor to the new champion. Don't cause any trouble here. Got it? We use our power to keep his wrath from you. And Beliar knew his enemy. And his wrath was great. Welcome to Bakaresh. The city of Beliar, Pilgrim. My name is Amul. I am one of the Black Mages. Can I learn from you? Casting the spells of Beliar requires great wisdom. And? And I will not teach you before you have rendered outstanding services to the city of Bakaresh. Nice temple you've got here. Yes. You want to see the inside as well, don't you? But you will not set foot in the temple unless I permit you to do so. And what do I have to do for that? What do you think? Make yourself useful. You can find out everything else for yourself. No, we do not know if we can trust you. No, we do We are the chosen people. Wealth for us. Dominion for Beliar, and his dominion will come, and then those who have drawn his...